All right, an aqueous solution containing 35.9 grams of an unknown molecular compound in 150.0 gram of water has a freezing point of minus 1.3 degrees Celsius. Let's calculate the molar mass of the unknown compound. The freezing point depression, TF, is the temperature at the water freezes minus the freezing point of the solution. So the change in the <coughs> freezing point, temperature of water, solution. So that's 0 minus minus 1.3. And that would give you 1.3. Now, this delta TF is equal to I as the Van Hart's word, <coughs> the Van Hart's factor, KF, the freezing point depression constant, times the molality of the solution. So, 1.3 equals, since it's a molecular substance, that's one times the freezing point value for water is 1.858 times the molality of the solution. So the molality of the solution is 1.3 divided by 1.858. And that will give you 0 0.70 molar. Now the molality of the solution is the number of moles of the solute, the compound, divided by the kilogram of water of the solvent. And the number of moles of the compound itself is the mass of the compound divided by its molar mass. So I'm going to substitute this there. So I would say that 0 0.70 equals the mass, which is 35.9, divided by its molar mass, multiplied by the kilogram of water. We're giving 150.0 grams, divided that by 1,000. So you have 0 0.15. Zero, <clears throat> and the molar mass of the compound will be 35.9 divided by 0 0.150 times 0 0.7 and this will give you 342 gram per mole thank you